Good morning. It's Monday morning. I wanted to wish all of you a happy Memorial Day. And um, I'm excited to be here today. I am not sure which day it is of our sunflower celebration. I'm actually out at our local middle school. I took a walk and I didn't think that I could get home in time to do uh, a live at my house. So I didn't check my notes to tell me what day it is. Regardless if it's day 12 or day 13, um, our sunflower celebration is a time where we spend we choose something that we want to work on for ourselves and spend 100 days working on it and reflecting on our growth and seeing what changes we're making, what works and what doesn't work. And for me, it's pretty exciting because I am working on my social media. So doing this live is actually part of my of my project. Um, and at the end, the 100 days, we're gonna celebrate with a sunflower celebration. Um, today is Memorial Day, and it's not, um, I do not have anybody in my immediately fa immediate family who has served, and so I'm not sure that I have really ever fully realized the impact of this day for, for those families that do have people serving, but also really for the rest of our country who, um, who has benefit from living in this country where we have people who have served. My cousin um, lost her son about six weeks ago tragically and suddenly he was active duty I don't know if I have the terminology right he was a marine serving our country and um, since his passing she has been very open about sharing um, sharing what that has meant to her and especially this week she's taken the time to educate those of us that are kind of on the periphery to what their family has been experiencing about what it means to have somebody that you love pass away in service. Um, the, the thing that she told us today that it, it makes sense but I've never thought of it that Armed Forces Day is a day that we celebrate those people who are still in uniform and Veterans Day is the day that we celebrate those people who have served their country and hung up their uniform. But today, Memorial Day, is the day that we honor those people who didn't get a chance to get out of their uniform, that they were still serving when they passed. And, um, and I, I, having a cousin, you know, somebody as a mother who, who is going through this, it, it really is helping me understand um, the meaning of that a little better. Anyway, I just wanted to wish you all a happy Memorial Day, however you're celebrating, whatever family you've got, um, whether they've served or not served, and just if you have a few minutes today to spend reflecting on um, the benefits that we have in our country and the people that have served so that we can live here and, and have what we have. Okay, I love you all and I will talk to you later. Have a good day. I'll see you tomorrow for sure.